Good morning! It's our wedding day. It is. Are you ready? Uh, maybe. Do you know what you're letting yourself in for? No. <laughs> Sunshine in my pocket, got that good soul in my feet. I feel that hot blood in my body when it drops. Ooh, I can't take my eyes off of it. Moving so phenomenally. You more like the way we rock it, so don't stop. He is also quite clever, though I will not tell him this for now. <laughs> I like this lovely other dinosaur, thought the dinosaur. She is beautiful and she is different and she smells so nice. She is also a free spirit, which is, quite, which is a quality I much admire in a dinosaur. But he can be so distant and so peculiar at times, thought the lovely other dinosaur. He is also overly fond of things. Are all dinosaurs so overly fond of things? But her mind skips from here to there so quickly, thought the dinosaur. She's also uncommonly keen on shopping. <laughs> Are all lovely other dinosaurs so uncommonly keen on shopping? I will forgive her skipping mind and fondness for shopping, thought the dinosaur, for she fills our life with beautiful thoughts and wonderful surprises. Besides, I am not unkeen on shopping either. <laughs> now the dinosaur and the lovely other dinosaur are old. Look at them, they stand on the hill telling each other stories and feeling the warmth of the sun on their backs. And that, my friends, is how it is with love. Let us all be dinosaurs and lovely other dinosaurs together. For the sun is warm and the world is a beautiful place. never leaves the seat up, or wet towels upon the floor. The toothpaste has the lid on, and he always shuts the door. She's very clean and tidy, though she may sometimes delude. Leave your things out at 
your peril in a second of mood. He's a very active person, as are all his next of kin. Whereas she likes lazy days, he'll still drag her to the gym. He romances her and dines her, M&S meals and the like. He even knows her favourite food and spoils her day and night. She's thoughtful when he looks at her, a smile upon his face. Will he look that good in 20 years when his dentures aren't in place? <laughs> he says he loves him, her figure and her mental prowess too. But when gravity takes her over, will she charm with her IQ? <laughs> she says she loves his kindness and his patience is a must. And of course, she thinks he's handsome, which in her eyes is a plus. <laughs> They're both not wholly perfect, but who are we to judge? He can be pig-headed, whereas she won't even budge. <laughs> All that said and done, they love the time they spend together. And I hope, as I'm sure you do, that this fine day will last forever. He'll be more than just her husband, he'll also be her friend. And she'll be more than just his wife, she'll be his soulmate until the end. Phil, do you take Sarah to give you a wedded life? To share your life with her? To love, support? and comfort her, whatever the future may bring. So, do you take Leon to be your wedded husband? To share your life with him, to love, support and comfort him, whatever the future may bring. I call upon these persons here present. I call upon these persons here present. To witness that I feel Terry. That I feel Terry. Do take this Sarah Corbell. Do take this Sarah Corbell. To be my lawful wedded wife. To be my lawful wedded wife. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. From this day forward until death do us part. From this day forward till death do us part. She was someone I used to see, a yummy mummy in an SUV. <laughs> Occasional chat swelled out on the tiles, the room always lit with her smiles. Times passed and our lives moved on, but a cycle changed me from that time on. Although it was hard, she always had a smile. She grew on me with every single mile. It was such fun to talk, I'd even have got off to walk. I knew I liked her, but a flight altered that. She opened up my mind every minute that I sat. She got into my head, she got into my soul. I fell in love with her, my heart she stole. At first I saw her as a maid back home. Took her to the movies on her own. Nothing happened, wasn't meant to be. Maybe we should just wait and see. The odd fuzzy feeling was enough perhaps. Or should we just let it lapse? Being mates would be good, at least I'd see her when I could. Good food with friends, full of chat. How could a dinner change all that? Shoes on, coat on, I was ready to go. What happened next, I could not know. The nicest kiss, her warm embrace, the passionate look upon her face. Wow, my lovely friend. <laughs> I can't concentrate.
straight, I can't blink. So many warm, fuzzy feelings, I can't think. I hope this feeling will never end. My heart of butter, do you send? Sarah, I'm so in love with you. I know you feel it too. Thank you. I call upon these persons here present to witness that I, Sarah Cobalt, do take the victory to be my lawful wedded husband, to have and to hold from this day forward. For better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish from this day forward until death will start. My father's team is simple, I'll endure until the end. I'll be your one and only, you will never end in prayer. I'll listen and I'll nudge, I'll fight and I'll be true. I'll do my equal share and I'll never be loving you. I'll try to do my best to fulfill your every need. I'll walk beside you and I'll hold you to succeed. I'll be your constant equal and I'll give you room to grow. I'll tend to you when you are sick, but you are in your own way. Stand before these witnesses and I say thank you. No matter what hard times you face, Sarah and Phil, you have both made a solemn and binding contract with each other in the presence of the witnesses he has involved. It gives me the greatest honor and privilege to pronounce you husband and wife. Ladies and gentlemen, please applause Mr. and Mrs. Terry.
Make sure you're ready. Sun's going down. <laughs> Gonna have a great time. <laughs> Yay. So what you wanna do? Let's just run, girl. If we wake up and you wanna break up, that's cool. Would you raise your glass and welcome in the new Mr. and Mrs. Terry? Oh, girl. Don't say no. Fantastic, fantastic day, and I can see over there behind the, uh, the building. And Phil is now getting up to say a few more mumbles. Uh, but you guys are stunning, beautiful, love you very much. Okay, I'm gonna go back now to the wedding party. Okay. Just had to say I've been uh, taken behind by John and told me that I need to make the slowest possible because he's gone for about an hour for all the speeches so I'm going to slow it right down. Um, I'd just like to start off by saying a massive thank you to everybody working at this amazing venue putting on an incredible effort for today. So when mum asked me if I would walk her down the aisle today I was, uh, I was, I was really emotional to be fair. It was, uh, it was a real honour for me and I thank you for asking me to do it. It's uh, it amazing for me today. And, uh, but when she asked me, I kind of realised I've got to do a speech. Um, and, uh, and it got me thinking, because um, when we... I've only ever been to one other wedding before, of course, Auntie Lorna and John's just there. And Mum was maid of honour that day. And, uh, and Mum came to me just before the wedding. She said, Elliot, I've got to do a speech at Lorna's wedding. I'm really nervous. I don't know what to do. And I was going, oh, what do you want me to do about it? I'm useless. <laughs> and she goes, well, I've been on YouTube. And I've been watching these videos of maid of honours and best men doing raps and doing songs and doing funny spoof things for basically to get out of doing a speech. Right. So mum came to me, I play a little bit of guitar, mum came to me and said, Elliot, let's do something silly. Right. So I said, amazing idea, let's do it. So mum went away and she took the song, Hey There Delilah, by the Plain White Tees, we all know it. Mm -hmm. And she changed the lyrics, she ordered it a little bit and wrote this amazing song about John and Lorna and we played it at the wedding and it was a load of fun and we all did it. And it got me thinking that because obviously I'd been involved with that, Mum was probably going to expect me to do something similar. <laughs> and, uh, and you'd be and you'd be exactly right. That's what's going on. So if you excuse me. <laughs> Jesus, I'm going to cry again. <laughs> this is ridiculous. I agree. Thank you, Pa. It's a little early in the song for me to say. Things about mum that make you so great I think it's fair to say everybody agrees Today you stole the show and you did it oh so effortlessly It must have been a real honour to walk down the aisle With your favourite child <laughs> Mum's not invincible Two vodka cranberries normally has her on the floor And I can't pretend that it doesn't fill me up with glee To find funny ways of toying with your OCD And even though most of the guests try to be late They all made it here for you on your wedding day. On your wedding day. <laughs> but we can't forget the groom, Phil. We think you're great. Think you're uh, great. <laughs> the love that you have for our mum and the way that you treat her. Mum, you deserve all the love that there can be. Aww. And Phil, 
it's like the man who can give you all of that to me. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. So ladies and gentlemen, please raise your glass to the newly wedded pair. I can't take much credit. Uh, I, uh, <laughs> my wife and I. so much for coming such a long way to celebrate with us today and making it so special. It's very difficult for some of you. <laughs> well, we are so sorry that some of you had such a hard time to get here, so I'm sorry. Um, but we are very thankful to French counterintelligence to let Zara, uh, Dara and Zara, Zara. 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 thank you. Zara. Because yeah. without them, as you can imagine, it wouldn't have been quite the same. She hasn't been quiet. Quite loud already, to be honest. Uh, so it means a lot to my wife and I to spend all our life savings on you lot. So the next one is about Sarah, the most important person here today, as I think you will all agree. Okay, so you are as beautiful ever, and your smile, as always, lights up the room. I always knew that I was punching above my weight, wasn't I, Trevor? <laughs> I, I hear on every cycle trip I go on, from most of the other guys on the trip, are you really still together? <laughs> it's tough, but she has been you know, very generous. <laughs> As you can imagine, I do try quite hard, and eventually Sarah said yes. So I can thank my lucky stars, that I'm so fortunate to be able to spend the rest of my life with you. Woo! And I think the fact that I said in the church probably summed up everything about my feelings for you. So, the next one is, I haven't actually gained a beautiful wife. I've also gained a new family. Oh. Oh. Okay. So, anyway, think of the inheritance. And I like that. <laughs> the, last, the last few years have been great, living with Jess and Laurie particularly, but also getting to know Elliot better because he lives away. Um, right, so I, I mustn't also forget the two boys in my life who I'm very proud of. They've grown up so much in the last year. They are working so hard and I am so proud of them doing so well. Yeah. 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 So now it's time to mention Maria. <laughs> it is lovely that we can share our special day with you today and we get the chance to thank you for all your help and support both today and in our lives. Thank you very much, Maria. Well Finally, and I'm sure you'll be pleased with that, I'm, I'm, I would like to mention a few people who aren't here today. My dad and my mum, for various reasons. Sarah's dad. Um, wherever they are, I think they are missing out on one hell of a party. I would actually like to raise your glasses, so we now have some to raise. I would like to raise a toast to my best man, to the guests, to absent friends, to my new family, and to Sarah. Mesdames, Messieurs, <laughs> bonjour tout le monde, <laughs> et bienvenue au Château de Varennes pour fêter le mariage de Monsieur et Madame Terry. <laughs> D'abord, Mesdames, Messieurs, je vous prie vous lever et de porter un toast aux mariés. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, Phil and I met around 13 years ago. And Phil invited me to uh, take my dental practice into Indigo Medical. Uh, Phil was the driving force behind this uh, new adventure. And he was convinced it would be the best thing I could do for my future. 
and for his. Phil <laughs> <laughs> uh, so and I have this passion for cycling and uh, during the following years we had many adventures together. The first of which was uh, a trip through Peru. It's about 600 miles and we, we shared a tent. And it was then I, I discovered Phil's competitive streak <laughs> because he always wanted to be in front. And every day he would race to the tent, you know, and just be first back to the tent. And it took me about four days to realise he wanted the least bumpy side. Oh, yes. So that was Phil. <laughs> anyway, our cycling adventures have carried on and we've had various trips as Phil said, most of them being a liver test more than a cycle test. <laughs> anyway, right, now you may be wondering what's in your underwear. Well, I've only known Phil for 13 or 14 years. And I've never known Phil in his younger life, and I never knew what he would look like with hair. <laughs> so, we're going to have a little look at Phil with various hairstyles, and then we're going to vote which one you think would have suited his hair. Now you can open and have a look. <laughs> Oh, my God. 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 Oh, my God.
Gotta be cool, really get it, get on my tracks to the back seat. Take a long ride on my motorbike to the ready, 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 raise a little thing all over.
it's clearly it's ten o'clock in the morning and we are the first up for breakfast. Paradise whenever I'm with you, my mind. My mind, my mind, my mind, well it's a paradise whenever I'm with you, right on. I will ride on down the road, I will find you, I will hold you, I'll be there, it's long. Well, it's a mighty long road, but I'll find you, I will hold you, and I'll be there. I know you heard it from those other boys, but this time it's real, it's something that I feel it. I know you heard it from those other boys, but this time. Okay, so Phil in his very embarrassing t shirt. Wow. Right, Elliot well, thinks he's going to beat me at table tennis, but we both know it's just not going to happen. My time, my time will live to never end in hell to skelter. We'll be out whatever the weather. My heart, my boom, boom, heart, it's a beat, and it's a thumping, and I'm alive. And raise your glasses again. Raise your asses. For entertaining us all, inviting us all to the most perfect weekend. Best day ever. Yeah. Yeah. That's what makes special for me. I mean, this place is amazing, but it is just, we could be anywhere, and as long as you guys are here with us, that's all oh. 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 So, <laughs> the boys. Uh oh. Very, very special bunch of guys. And my husband, obviously. Oh. 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 <laughs> But especially want to mention my boys, Elliot and Laurie. So Elliot, who is maybe about to leave us and head off to New Zealand for God knows how long. Ooh. Ooh. Exciting. Exciting. Laurie, who's heading off, where are you? It's here. It's just the heading off to university. I know, I shine. Good knows what's going on. But I also have two new boys in my house. Oh. Oh. No, so Ollie and Tom both gone into very, very different professions. Can't wait to try Tom's. I hope they might never get a need on it. Who is the best tennis player? Oh, my God. Ooh. Oh, yeah. oh. Oh. Well done, Phil. That was a <laughs> Who has the last word? Oh. <laughs> Who wears the trousers? Easy. <laughs> 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 very long.